On the eleventh day of data science, my model gave to me eleven aspen things. Wait, what? <laughs> what does that mean? I'm I'm sorry. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Graham, yeah. Graham, this one's this one's this one's too nerdy even for me. I you put this on. You're gonna do this. Okay. I'm going home. See you later. Okie dokie. So maybe you've noticed that on the back of most books is a number. It's called an ISBN. And if you've looked very closely at them, maybe you've noticed that just once in a while, it ends in an X for no obvious reason. Uh, and I want to talk about why. Because, first of all, if you have noticed that, congratulations, that's three points towards your autism diagnosis. And second of all, you've probably just rediscovered modular arithmetic. So what do I mean by that? So ISBNs are often typed by hand, and so the last digit is there is what's called a check digit to detect uh, typos uh, make in that number. And the way we do that is a simple mathematical sum of the other digits, add them up, and take the last digit of that sum. However, it turns out that doing that sum using base 10 arithmetic is not ideal, and that's to do with the fact that 10 is not a prime number. And so we do the sum in base 11 arithmetic. Uh, and that leaves us with just one final problem, and that is what happens if the remainder happens to be a 10, given there's no decimal digit for 10. And so what happens is uh, we, chose, we took the Roman numeral X to mean 10. The full video is available on our profile. Go watch it now.